Hello everyone, today we're talking about element number 113, Nihonium, artificially produced transuranium element of atomic number 113. So in 2004, scientists at Riken Nishina Center for Accelerator-Based Science in Saitama, Japan, announced the production of one atom of element 113, which was formed when bismuth-209 was fused with zinc-70, creating Nihonium-113. Extremely radioactive, the atom decayed through emission of alpha particles which is a helium nuclei without its electrons. Losing the helium nucleus, it decayed to dubnium-262 in about 2.5 seconds. Its chemical properties may be similar to those of thallium. The element has six isotopes with known and confirmed half-lives, the longest lived of which is Nihonium-286, with a half-life of 19.6 seconds. Most of these radioactive isotopes were not directly synthesized, but occurred as decay products. In January 2016, the discovery of element 113 was recognized by the International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry, or IUPAC, and the International Union of Pure and Applied Physics, or IUPAP. The discoverers named it Nihonium after the Japanese word for Japan. The name Nihonium was approved by IUPAC in November of 2016. So that was Nihonium explained in as a short amount of time as possible. If you like this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Other than that, thank you everyone for watching. Have a great one.